What's going on everyone? Welcome back. I hope everybody had a great day. All right guys, I said in my last video at the very end of it that I would actually be doing a moon video about a particular moon photo, right? So basically I'm, I'm just asking the question on this. Are we going to be looking at a simple hillside or are we looking at a crashed craft that NASA might have modified to kind of make it look and really blend in like one? Let's have a look. And guys, just to be clear, I don't care which one it is. If it's a, if it's a hillside, awesome. Struck me a little weird and I figured I, I questioned it a little bit. I want to let you guys give me your comment. Tell me what you think. Nothing more than a hillside? Great. You think it's more than that? Drop your comments down below. Okay, so let's get started. All right, the photo we're going to be looking at, it's right here from space.com, which is basically run by NASA. Uh, and it, they're basically talking about the, the moon buggy debut, so um, how they started using it and how they had problems with the front electric wheels on it, so they ended up just using the rear wheel, all this other crap. I'm interested in the photo itself, right? And what I'm looking at is this object right here on the right-hand side. Now, right off the bat, I thought hillside. That's what I thought. It's just another mound. It's off in the back, and it's not a big deal. Until I really started to look at it. Then I went, uh, okay. So I'm going to share my findings with you guys, and you tell me what you think. Okay, so let's jump into this so we can go way in on this photo. And I'll tell you why it kind of stuck out for me. I don't know what you guys, if you guys are looking at a high-definition screen, but you can see what looks like a couple little details here. There's one, something right here. Just kind of looks like maybe a slight detail. It could be nothing more than the hillside, uh, just the ripples in the sand or the, the hillside itself, right? But what had me puzzled was this stripe right here, right? Now, let's back up for a second because I want to show you. If you were to look at the direction of the sun, which is right here, you could see what I did right here was from this instrument here. You can see there's a couple antennas right here. You got your um, highly directive antenna. You got the dish antenna, basically. It's a mesh, but not solid. Um, and you've got, I think this is, I'm not sure if this is another antenna right here. Doesn't really matter. The instruments here on the vehicle, you can see the sun in this direction, and you can see the equipment sticking up. And so it's not that far, right? But you can see it's going in this direction. So, if we were to look at that, okay, you can see the arrow, which way it's going. And this is what I'm seeing. Here's the outline of it right here. That's what I'm seeing right here. Now, let me just jump back a little bit. Now, when I look at this, now let's suppose for a moment. Let's do this right here. Let's get this one right. Yeah, we could pick any of the color that will stand out. doesn't really matter. Let's pick anything. Um, let's suppose for a moment. Like this hillside, we have this shadowing. Okay? Now, let's suppose for a moment this is also the same right here. So, let's say this is the, the shadow of this particular hill. Okay, I get that. Again, we've got the sun coming from this direction. Okay, so this is what puzzles me. I get, so you can see the, the light shining on this particular area right here. You can see that. But then you get this weird-looking stripe thing. And then it's light, so it's dark here, and then light again here. Is it possible it's in between the actual hills? That's a good possibility too, right? So let's jump back into this. I want to show you what I've got in hands. And I'm going to show you another small anomaly that's on the ground right next to the actual moon buggy as well as the astronaut, right? So this is what I saw. And when I started to just enhance this thing, this is what popped out. Now, I did make this darker so you can see this a little bit better. You can see what looks like there's something right, right here. See this? Look at this real closely right here. You can see something going like this and doing the same thing on the other side. But you can also get this, this line going like this. It's just funky. The way this thing is actually have an outline. Now, let me enhance it a little bit differently. And you can see what looks like this weird line now, I can go back and forth, and you can see that line right here. Now, to me, the way I see this thing, this could be either or. This could be a simple uh, hillside. But, again, let's take a look at this, these details right here. You can see this weird kind of piece coming down, doing the same thing on the other side. And we've got this line going like this. I mean, just bizarre-looking stuff, guys. This is coming down, and then you've got what looks like this little almost like rectangular object right there. You guys see that? Check that out. If it is a hillside, I'm okay with that. Is it possible there's something laying on this hillside or more than one object? Is it possible it's it, it, every bit of this is something else? In other words, it's not a hill. Because I'm looking at that now, and think about this. This would be perfect as far as NASA going, oh, what the hell, it blends, so just let it be. And because all I got to do is just kind of like take out all of the dark spots and you'd be none the wiser. Well, let's do it this way. 
Now I'm going to go back and forth on this thing, so just have a look, and you can see where the lines are. I'm going to go in a little closer, zoom in just a hair bit more, and then tell me what you guys think. You can see these lines are in fact there. If you've got a good high-definition monitor, you can see these things. They are actually there. So this is what kind of caught my attention, right? So now you guys tell me what you think. Is nothing more than a hillside? Cool. Is it a craft? More cool. <laughs> I mean, that's the way I look at it, right? But let me show you guys something else that was pretty wild. It looks like a bunch, well, not a bunch, but a couple little pipes laying right here on the ground. You guys see that right here? Right here. You can see what it looks like. It goes like this, goes back, and goes over to here. This one does the same exact thing. I'm not sure what that is. It may not be. It may be just something, a glitch in the photo. Good possibility, right? And way back here, I don't know if I can bring these out for you guys, because I did this the first time. In fact, we'll, yeah, we'll do the mid-tones here. You've got these other white objects that are laying right here on the ground. See them? If I go t right there, you got one and two, and then some other little white thing just laying right there. See that? Going like this. I'm not sure what to make of those, but they're there. Right in there. Now, that may, again, these may be just shadows and it's nothing special there. That's a possibility. Guys, I got some more interesting things coming up. In fact, I saw something else in another photo on the moon. And again, it looks like some kind of weird structure or uh, craft. And, and like I said, I'll let you guys have, uh, have a look at that as well. Now, again, I'm, I'm on the fence about this, and truthfully, when I first seen this, it could be anything. This could be just, just simply a uh, hillside with maybe something on it. Maybe it's something laying on the hillside, or it's been disguised as a hillside, or it's not a hillside at all. It's a craft. But you guys give me your comments down below. Let me know what you think. And again, like I said, I've got more uh, Mars coming up, uh, a couple gigapans we're going to be looking at. Uh, which will be longer videos, right? As well as more moon. So we're going to shuffle them up, throw them in there, and then uh, we're going to get them out to you guys, right? Anyway, guys, I'm not going to keep it much longer. Uh, I figured you guys would like that because for me, shadowing is everything, right? Light and shadows. Um, it makes you wonder, is, is some of these things, you know, are they nothing more than natural occurring? Or is it something that's been disguised to make it look natural? Or is it just because it's off in the distance? They said, oh, the hell with it. And, um... You know, maybe they won't notice it. Who knows? Um, anyway, guys, drop your comments down below. Like and share, as always. And I'll see you guys on the flip side.